Karen's Body Beautiful Hair Milk. So I don't know if you can see that. And this was unscented, so I had to add my own scents to it. Again, this product is empty. This hair milk is very liquidy, very lightweight. I'm trying to see if I have the ingredients on here. I can't really, I can't really read the ingredients. Whatever's on here. Oh, okay, now I can kind of read it. It has water, jojoba, and al avocado oil. It has vegetable wax, and it has a variety of herbs, echinacea, nettle, wheat germ oil, glycerin. So it has some natural enzymes in there. It's a very, very nice product. But I just want to let you know the, the majority ingredient in this bottle is water, by far. This is a very liquidy, watery product. There is not very much oil in here at all. So if you're using this, understand that the main thing you are getting is creamy water. And it's called hair milk. The consistency is very similar to milk. The oils in here are good, but it's not anywhere close to being a cream or a butter. It's more of a milky, light, lotiony consistency. And useful for detangling, adding moisture to the hair. I don't know that I will repurchase it because I feel like I can just use my spritzers, which are basically water products, and I can make them myself for maybe 50 cents for this amount of product and put a scent I like in there and then just use my deep conditioners or some richer product. So I don't think I really have a place in my repertoire for hair mix, hair milks, or these light liquidy leave-in conditioners. I am going to try detanglers this winter as a step to see if I can retain more hair by using a detangler. This has detangling properties to it, but I didn't find it to be extremely detangling, nor did I find it to offer a lot of scent. I mean, not scent, slip. I didn't find this product, to, this Karen Body Beautiful hair milk to offer a lot of slip. I found that I would consider it basically like a light glycerin type product. And let me see, do they have glycerin in here? Yeah, they have glycerin in here. They have glycerin and some oils in here. It doesn't take much glycerin. but And I think that if I'm going to just purchase glycerin, I don't need to spend... Karen body beautiful type of money. I could just go buy some carefee curl or some vegetable glycerin from the health food store and put some water in there. This is unscented, so I'm not getting the fragrance here. And so as a product, I like it. I used it all. It was beneficial moisturizing my hair, but I don't believe that this is a good economical choice for those of us who are natural. I believe get make your own spritz, you know, mix some glycerin and water. And as far as oils, you we're gonna use we're gonna have to use oils anyway. This product is not gonna take the place of oils for you. You will need to seal this product in. So you might as well just seal in your own glycerin and water and finish it off with the oils that you would use anyway, instead of having it all mixed up because not enough oil in here for the natural person's hair like myself. Just not enough. Now, if you just want to use a lightweight, milk-like product, then I would recommend this product to you. It is a good product. It does moisturize my hair. No, it doesn't really moisturize my hair. I'm sorry. It does hydrate my hair and offer just a little bit of moisturizer too. So, it's good in that sense. I don't use this on the day that I wash my hair. I use it maybe the night before I go to sleep or something like that to put the moisture into my hair. And it's good for that. But, I mean, I just think as a natural, we really need to be cognizant of how many products that we are using. And for me, the hair milk, the light, light hair milk, milk that's almost a glycerin product I don't really find a purpose for that in my wardrobe of hair products if I have it I will use it but if I do not have it 
I think that the the dot I would do better to buy a heavy cream or a good oil moisturizer or a, a some basic products from the health food store and just mix some glycerin and water. So that's my review. It's a good product. It does hydrate your hair. Has a little bit of oil in it to kind of seal. You would still need oil with this product. It's very very light, very very flimsy, hydrating product.